hey 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 welcome back to my channel if you knew you're welcome and i hope you stay today i'm going to show you how i make my popcorn this is a sweet and milky popcorn without wasting time let's just get started i'll get a bowl and come in with about two to three tablespoonful of sugar Next, i'll come in with about two tablespoonful of powdered milk a pinch of salt to taste I'll get my corn I'll be using about a handful so a little bit goes a very long way let's get ready to make the popcorn I'll put a non-stick pan on fire I'll come in with a little bit of oil I'll use about a tablespoon of oil I'm using groundnut oil this is great because it is tasteless and odorless for the oil to heat up don't forget we're doing this on medium fire i feel it's hot i'll just drop in a grain of maize wait till it pops as you can see it's not popping so i'll drop in another one you can see one has popped which indicates the oil is hot enough for the corn i'll go ahead and pour in the rest of the corn I'll sway the pan occasionally say if you're gonna make popcorn you should know that some grains will never pop you pour the corn in before the oil is hot enough there is a very high possibility that you're going to end up with burnt popcorn and you cannot even eat them. I must confess, I learned this the hard way. As you can see, they are all popping and you can see I'm giving it occasional sways. I like to use a glass saucepan cover to help me see what's happening in there. So basically this will take about two minutes. All the grains are popped. Okay, there are some grains which will never ever pop so just ignore them. It is ready now, I'll just put off the fire. Whilst it's still warm, I'll pour my mixture of sugar and milk onto it. And I'll just swirl it around. Ladies and gentlemen, our popcorn is ready. This is a sweet, milky popcorn. So you can add some more salt if you feel the salt is not enough. This is it guys and I hope it did help you. If you've not subscribed, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye bye.